Okay, so <clears throat> here's something else that um, I think is interesting. Um, you might have seen the fill handle. That's what I just did here. I'm going to do that. You see this little thing here, this little corner square? If I pull this down, it drags these formulas down. So if I have two more asking favorite drink and favorite food, then that's already done for you. Okay, now what happens if we take these two, we control C and control, uh, actually control shift V, but I'm going to use paste special just so you see what I'm doing. I'm going to paste just the values. Actually, I'm going to paste conditional formatting just to sort of see what happens here. Okay. Paste values only. Okay. Now I've got three things here. So I'm going to go and take these three things. I'm going to copy them. And now we're going to see if we have a problem or not. If I control V, you'll notice there's some strange things here. There's this here. There's this here. And that will just sort of interfere. I can do it like this. Um, but again, it's a bit annoying. So coffee, pancakes, pancakes, pancakes. Okay, so that's a bit annoying. What you can do, which is very useful if there's a lot of them, is to actually have a untitled document. You can use whatever you want for this. And we're just going to find a replace. So I went to this one here. Copy. Go to the untitled uh, thing. And now, because there's this, there's all these things. I, what I do is I go to edit, find and replace, find the things, replace with nothing. Replace all. And that'll just eliminate them for you. And then I just do control A, select all, control C, copy, go to the dialog here, control V, got all that done, and I convert. Once that's converted, I download it, and then I would just put that in the robot. I would change the name to something like pancakes and coffee and uh, and and that's how I would have the, uh, the the thing done very very quickly. Okay, so that's about it. Hope that's useful.